What's your, who are your starting corners? Uh, you Armani think? Reeves and Duran Grant. And, and Armani Reeves, we know about Duran. Armani Reeves, just talk about him a little bit. Why, why has he got that job at, the, at this point? Incredible offseason, great spring, worked really hard, understands the game, very committed, very focused. Uh, still has to play. Yeah. Still has to play. So we'll find out uh, on the 31st. But he's going to line up and he's going to play. And uh, I'm excited to see him play, to be honest with you. What's your pick in order behind those two guys right now? I don't now? know. don't have one. Really? i got yeah. three freshmen. Apple, they're, battling Burroughs, their butt okay. off. Yeah. they're battling their butt off. They're learning. They're learning to get yelled at. They're learning to have some resiliency. They're learning to keep battling. And to be honest with you, probably the guy who, who makes it through that the best is the guy that's going to play the most. But I would expect all of them to play this year. Are they both? Are they? Are, are, Y'all still play bench field, right? I mean, uh, correct. Yeah. Uh, who's working at the Who's working at the bench for the for the first game? Yeah, Duran will play some boundary. Armani will play some boundary. Uh, Duran's played field most of the time uh, this this uh, fall camp, but he's going to play boundary uh, the next couple of days, mm -hmm. and, and we're going to be interchangeable. I think a little bit more so than we will be. Uh, as the season progresses, um, and then with the young guys, most likely they'll be field guys for now and work their way into the boundary. Okay, how, good is in there? how good is this group compared to some of these coaches? We're, we're going to be good regardless of who's in there. I appreciate yep. the question, but I yep. want to make sure I'm very, very clear. Mm -hmm. We're going to be good regardless of who's in there. Thank you for the question. Okay, how did Bradley respond when, when that suspension did come down? And maybe he hoped with the lessening of the charges that he wouldn't get to play all 12 games during the regular season. I don't know. I really don't have a comment about that. He's always been a leader, as Bradley Roby is. Can he still be a captain of this team even coming off the suspension? I, I don't make those decisions or pick those guys. I can tell you this. When you walk into my meeting room, he's a leader every day. He communicates extremely well with the young players. He's a teacher. He, he's, he's a professional. He does his business like a pro. He practices like a pro. He watches film like a pro. And uh, they're learning from him how to play the, 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 the art of playing corner. And I appreciate that uh, very, very much. Kerry, if there's an area that on this team would ask questions it's on the defense, do you have any questions about the defense? Nope. <laughs> They're as good as last year, or how would you? Where Where are you? I think our, our intent would be now? to be. No, a year ago. I think our intent would. Well, I, I didn't have a feeling a year ago because I didn't. My first time being here, to be honest with you, uh, I think our intent would be to be better than last year. I, I mean, I, I think that's the mission of every coaching staff everywhere across the country. And uh, so we've got a lot of young players that I think are going to play really, really hard. Um, I, I love our scheme. I, I love the guys that I coach with. And I think we're going to play. You know, we're getting tested every day, too, because I'm going to tell you what, that offense on the other side of the ball, they're special. So it's, it's a really good experience every single day. Being a new starter, Duran's obviously a guy that other quarterbacks will probably try to, I guess, pick on even when Bradley returns. Do you see a guy that is kind of looking forward and ready for those type of tests? Boy, he had a great day today. He had a great day today. He, he, he was tested by Philly and Devin and Evan and everybody and their brother today, and he responded incredibly well. You know, if you're going to play this position at this level, you're, you're, you better hope to be tested. That's why you want to be there. You know, you're standing out there on an island all by yourself. It takes a man's man to play corner in, in the Big Ten Conference, and, and I would expect that he's uh, really excited about that. Terry, can you talk about the star position? Is that Tyvis Powell's job, and is he being pushed by Bogart and, and Von Bell? Just can you talk about that position, kind of break it down for us? I would say he's absolutely being pushed by Von Bell. I think Von Bell is a talented player. I would like to think that our guys are being pushed in every direction by everybody. Otherwise, why would those other kids be here? You know, if you come in and you're content with being a backup or you're content with not playing, and I just had this discussion with my guys, if all they want to do is come watch the other guys play, it, this is the wrong place for them. They ought to be coming here trying to beat those guys out. And I think those young freshmen have come in with that mindset and that demeanor. And if you're a guy like Tyvis Powell, you, you got to go earn your job every day. You know, and, and, and so do all the rest of those guys. Is Bogart healthy? Uh, yes. 100%? Yes, but he's okay. not playing at the start. He's not playing star, he's just, what, just safety? Safety and dime. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. What, yep. Yeah, what is your pecking order then at the dime? You said before that's a little bit of a different spot. The, the dime spot right now is Pitt Brown, uh, Cam Burroughs, and, and, uh, and Devin Bogart. They're all fighting for that. Do you feel good having, you know, especially with Bradley being going through what he's going through, having those veterans at safety kind of take charge of things in the back end? Love to have veterans uh, at any time. I think the great thing about those two safeties is they're really good communicators. Uh, they're, they're patient with the young guys, but they're also very assertive. They're not going to let the young guys come in and make mistakes. They're going to hold them accountable, and I think that's important. If you're out on the field with Christian Bryant, he's going to let you know if you screw up, and that's a good thing for a young player to have that, to have that pressure because that's what it's going to be like in, in 15 days or whenever we play, 12 days, whatever it is. Is Bryant one of these guys that's stepping up as a senior?